Feedback is another really fundamental skill. And um, I'd say that everyone is always getting better at feedback. We're always getting better at delivering feedback, and we're always getting better at receiving feedback. And this isn't something that comes naturally really to anyone. We have to work really hard to give good feedback. And we have to work really hard to get people to give us honest feedback. Um, and so we emphasize this a lot in the course. If you have a bad relationship with someone and you give them some feedback, it's likely to be taken as punishment. If you have a good relationship with someone and you give them some feedback, it's likely to be taken as encouragement or reinforcement. So just kind of drive this home. Think about somebody that you really, really don't like. If that person said to you, I thought you did good today, how would that feel? Would you care? If that person said, I want you to change this one thing, would you want to change it? Probably not. But now I want you to think about somebody that you highly respect. And if that person said to you, I thought you did good today, would you care? And if that person said, here's this one thing I want you to change, would you want to change it? It's a lot different, isn't it, based on what your relationship is with that person. When people tell me, the feedback I'm delivering isn't landing the way that I want it to, it's not working very well, then I tell them that you need to back up and work on the relationship. It's not necessarily the feedback that it, that's the problem, it's the relationship that's the problem, and that's the aspect that needs to be addressed. And, and I think we far too often think about the exact wording of the feedback and not the context that we're giving it in. <laughs>